God. Immortal shell. There is a maker for a pot or a table. So there must be a creator for the marvelous world also. That creator is God. God is a wire puller, super God standing behind the machine of this world. He is even dealer of your heart. He is precise over all action, his karma jaksha. He is a dispenser of the fruits of action, of, the, of your action. Living God by singing his name, repeating his mantra, and serving the fruits of your actions unto him. The Lord abides in every creation, the creature. Behold the Lord in all objects, in all manifestations. He is in the breath of the voice, in the voice, in the eyes. He is the life of your life, soul of your soul. Make no distinction between the Hindu and the Bhagavad the Protestant and the Catholic, the Shaivite and the Vaishnavite. Within you is the heat of God. Within you is the immortal soul. Within you is the inexhaustible spiritual pressure. Within you is the fountain of joy and happiness. Within you is the water of bliss. Look with him for the happiness you have sought in vain in the pleasurable sensual object. Rest peacefully the Lord Atma and drink the nectar of immortality. Ensure your life with God. Depend upon Him alone. All other mission companies will fail, but this divine company will never fail. You will not pay any premium to this divine company. You will have to love God only. You will have to give Him only your heart. Satyam, truth is the seed. Gurubhacharya, celibacy is the root. Meditation is the shower, shanti, peace is the flower, moksha, salvation is the truth. Therefore, speak truth, practice brahmacharya, and meditation, cultivate shanti. You will surely attain the final emancipation of freedom from the troubles of birth and death, and enjoy eternal bliss, supreme peace, perennial joy, and immortality. Surrender everything unto Him. Place your ego at his feet and be at his. He will take complete charge of you. If he mold you in any way he likes, he can do exactly as he wills. He will remove all defects and weaknesses. He will play beautifully in his body flute. Hear the marvelous music of the flute of the Lord, the mysterious music of the soul and the God. Peace is a divine attribute, it is a quality of the soul. It cannot remind the greedy person. It fills the pure heart. It is a sweet companion of sages and yogis. It besets the lustful. It runs away from the selfish. It is an ornament of the Paramahamsa. As you think, so you become. It is the immutable psychological law. Your thoughts make your life. You can choose your thoughts. You can choose your mode of thinking. You can make your life as you choose. If you entertain evil thoughts, you will lead a miserable life. If you cultivate sublime thoughts in the time of Godhead, may you all prosper gloriously. May you all live the divine life, singing Hari's name, serving the poor and the sick with Atma Bhav, sharing what he has with others, and melting the mind of the Lord through silent meditation. Oh.